Goldie here uh, with the card analysis video for Masters of the Universe Goldberg, the heroic human jackhammer. I'm um, just going to take a look at his tag links real quick and then we'll talk about his trainer ability uh, because he is a trainer, not a coach. So he gets your standard modern era, 5% more damage to gems, and then he has a Masters of the Universe link. Um, it's kind of curious about this one because with the zombies, it seems they have a new link every year. So I wasn't sure if the Masters of the Universe are going to be the same. Turns out they are not. So it's the standard moves that generate any color gems will, gen will create two more of those gems. So just your standard link. Trainer ability. He is uh, the same as the new Sasha that we got, uh, but he's Yellow Gems trainer. So the same as uh, the analysis I did for Stacy Keebler as a coach, but it's going to be for a trainer. So my numbers uh, for crossover value are going to be a little bit different. Um, with the coaching ability, I think the percentage topped out at 15. Uh, for trainers, it's 35. So that's gonna make things a little interesting. And I'm going to talk about that a little later on. Um, Again, this trainer is good for like at 9k, he's 2200 more flat damage. So if you have somebody um, that you need to use for a tour that you don't have leveled up or someone you need to do a jobber blitz with, you could put on Goldberg and Sasha for more yellow and blue gem damage and it'll help them punch up entirely. Um, so the other trainers for yellow gem damage, the percentage trainers are Showboat Cena, the original one, and Shane McMahon. And the crossover value for that is 6,286. So if you want higher, like if your yellow gems do higher than that, you'll want a percentage trainer. And if they do lower than that, you'll want to use Goldberg for flat. Um, there's only one card in the game that does damage per yellow gem, and that's Showboat JBL. Um, but I don't think a lot of people would run him with his finisher anyways. The I'm going to talk about two main people I think would be very beneficial. Um, the first is Adam Cole. For the super kick move. Um, he has a 1 MP move that increases his yellow gem damage by 50% for two turns. So at lower levels, Goldberg would probably be beneficial, but when you get him into higher levels, um, you'll probably want to switch to percentage. I'm going to pop over to the portal real quick because I want to show the crossover value. So the number was 6,286. So if you have a 5 star silver with 2 hollow stars, max level, their yellow gems are 6113. Uh, 6, so you want to use Goldberg. But if you fill one of the stars, they max out at 6452. So that's when you'd want to transition to a percentage gem trainer. And if we look on the portal just to see how that move scales, um, at 5 star silver, he's boosting his yellow gem damage by 98%. So he's basically doubling the gem damage. So for him, you'd want to use a percentage trainer at a higher level, but for lower levels, Goldberg will definitely be beneficial. Um, the other person I want to bring up is uh, Showboat Naomi. Let's type her into the portal here. And uh, five silver with a hollow, perfect. So normally she's run uh, double purple with the finisher, um, but if you have Lana to tag her with, are the tag links at the bottom? 
Oh, it doesn't say on the portal. Um, her and Lana have a tag, li tag link that boosts uh, gem damage by 100%. And Naomi has this roundhouse kick move um, that boosts yellow gem damage by 122% for three turns. So if you were to run her with this blue move and double purple, you lay down your reinforced gems, and then you turn them into yellows. And you're constantly boosting that gem damage. Um, she could be absolutely nuts, but at higher levels, you'll want to use the percent trainer. At lower levels, not so much, but even if you have her at level one, like she could punch up a whole lot that way. Um, so close down the portal. Um, on a lower scale, like Adam Cole and Showbot Naomi are the first two that come to mind in terms of doing like significant yellow gem damage. Uh, but at higher levels, you're going to want to go with either Shane or Showboat Cena. Um, one sleeper pick. See if I can find him on my roster. Because um, everybody has this card and we all just had to suffer through um, the PG tour. I saw a lot of people talking about how painful it was, and I absolutely sympathize. I struggled like hell to get through that. Uh, but Showboat Rock has a move where he increases his yellow gem damage by 30% for two turns. So using Goldberg on Showboat Rock probably would have really helped a lot of people <laughs> in this tour, myself included. It will definitely help him punch up. Um, other people, Showboat Piper, um, even though not a lot of people use him anymore. And um, Icons of WrestleMania, Brett, they also have moves that boost their yellow gem damage. Um, so again, uh, similar to Sasha's trainer, he can you can put him on a jobber. And um, it'll really help their punch up ability, especially if you're doing a tour or a blitz. Basically, any showboat at a lower level that you need to kind of boost their uh, yellow gem damage, putting Goldberg on as a coach, or as a trainer, rather, not an absolutely terrible idea. Um, so let me know in the comments who you think you're going to end up using him on. There's not a whole lot of options right now. Um, I think I'll be leading Showboat Rock if I ever need, just because I don't have any of the other cards. Um, it is quite limited, but I don't really see a situation where I'd use, like if I were to put him on Slick Rick, who's five silver, um, I'd probably lean towards a percentage trainer anyways. Uh, but let me know what you think of them switching to a flat gem damage uh, trainer. Let me know who you're going to put it on. Let me know uh, if you're chasing this MLC, what you think of uh, the character models, Masters of the Universe, all that kind of stuff. Let me know in the comments. Thank you very much for watching this video. Be sure to like, share with your friends, and subscribe so you're notified when my next gameplay video comes out. Thank you again for watching. Take care.